Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Joy Bettenhouse, and we'll have a chance for a few showers and storms this afternoon, but all rain clears out this evening. It's going to leave us with a mostly sunny Friday, finally some nice temperatures. And by Saturday, although there's a slim chance for an isolated shower and storm, it's going to be quite nice as temperatures heat up to near 80 degrees. The past 48 hours were soggy. You can see a lot of green across much of eastern Iowa, and it signifies between an inch to an inch and a half of rain from Decorah down to Waterloo over to Dubuque, even down near Washington. This blue swath, if you will, from Tana down to, Sig down to Sigourney is about a half inch, so most of eastern Iowa we saw it well over an inch of rain. Right now this morning, we have a little bit of drizzle out there and some fog. Otherwise, we've got this steady cloud cover that's not going to budge until later on tonight. It's all because this low pressure system, it's taking its time to get out of the Hawkeye State. You can see the rain wrapping around in counterclockwise fashion around the low, low pressure system there. We also have this warm front draped across our southeastern counties. That means our southeastern neighbors will be a bit warmer and will be slightly cooler across the north and west. Either way, we're warming things up across eastern Iowa for everyone by Friday. Temperatures are in the low 70s, plentiful 80s, starting near 80 at least on Saturday, going all the way to Wednesday. So if you have any outdoor plans this holiday weekend, you should be in good shape in terms of the weather. Maybe a stray shower this morning, but the better chance of showers and storms comes right around the lunchtime. Likely showers and storms will pop up in Missouri and move northward into our far southern counties, and likely these storms will stay in our southeastern counties throughout the afternoon. Some of these storms could become strong. The severe threat is looking low at this time, but we could see some small hail, gusty winds, or a heavy downpour out of these storms. By the evening commute, 4 o'clock here, it looks like the bulk of the rain moves out east, so that's good news for the evening commute. Any stray showers lingering on through the evening will likely wrap up by midnight, and cloud cover will push on out early Friday morning. Today's highs were in the low to mid-60s north and west, near 70 south and east, with a chance of showers and storms. Tonight, dropping down to the upper 40s, low 50s, as cloud cover finally decreases. City by city forecast, Waterloo, Dubuque, Cedar Rapids, and Iowa City. Tomorrow will be a beautiful day out of, after the couple dreary ones that we've had this week with highs near 70 degrees and sunshine. And we're well into the 80s for Memorial Day weekend.